Welcome back to Ozarks Fox AM. Vision Con kicks off next weekend, but it isn't just entertainment for adults. Today we're going to find out all about the fun features for kids, and here to tell us about it is Christine Gilbert. Nice to see you. Hi. Hi. I love your ears. Thank you. <laughs> she's all festive. <laughs> you are. Because she's running the kids department. What's in the kids department this year? Um, well, it's... Uh, like I said, this is only the second year we've actually had a full children's program. Mm -hmm. So we're still learning, but we had such a great success last year with a couple of features that we brought those back. Mm -hmm. And then we're trying some new things this year. Um, Ashley Wiggs, our mad scientist, is coming back to do a couple of demonstrations for the kids. Nice. Um, there's, uh, she's doing her pennies to gold demonstration. And then there'll be a hands-on slime making demonstration and she'll explain how that works for them and then they get to take the slime home. That was, <laughs> was very popular last year. <laughs> so that was last year and you said two things are coming back. Yeah, um, so we're, we're doing that again this year. Right. We're also bringing back our Pokemon and Monster Hunts. Oh, I bet that's good. That was, that was a lot of fun. We've restructured it a little bit. I think it's gonna work a little better this year. And yeah. I think the kids are gonna have a lot of fun going around Vision Con trying to spot oh, where, yes. we've, where we've hidden when them. When you say yeah. Pokemon, is that like Pokemon Go, like I used to play on my phone, is that similar? Um, it's, it's actually not. Um, what we have, we have, uh, a printed Pokédex, and we have hidden um, Pokémon around the convention center. Mm -hmm. So the idea uh. is that they go around with their parents and look for where we've hidden them. They might be in a vendor's booth, they might be peeking behind a banner on a wall someplace. Uh, I you just gotcha. never know where you're going to find one, and then they, they check it off, and when they found them all, they bring it back to us and, and get, their, get their prize. How fun is that? You know, <laughs> now, what age kids are we talking about? Um, younger kids usually for the want to do the pokey the Pokemon hunt. Mm -hmm. um, and usually they don't get much more than about eight. For older kids, we have a kaiju hunt, which okay. is similar, but it's like the big Japanese monsters. Mm. All right. Uh, so they get a different. They get their field hunters guide, and uh, they look for different monsters. But it's a very similar concept. And you know, we try to make the hiding places a little harder for the older right. kids. So you're you're playing to the smaller kids and the larger kids. And the kids. older kids, uh, we have. Um, something else that went over really well was the various crafts that we did. So we have a, we have both some structured craft time where they come in with their parents and, mm -hmm. and make something that we help guide them through. And we have a couple of blocks of time set aside just for unstructured craft time. Mom and dad can come in with their kids, just sit down, draw a picture, mm -hmm. make a little something, and leave with a nice souvenir of the weekend. That's great. Right. So what know. else is new this year for the kids? So you, you, you're, you're building on the success from last well, year. We are, definitely. And you're expanding. And, and we are expanding. Mm -hmm. um, new this year, we have a couple of bounce houses Ooh. that were donated by General Rental. Uh, uh, so we're very excited I about that. I even like those. I love bounce houses. <laughs> yeah. That's fun. That's for I know. Little kids and big kids. Uh, is there a weight limit? Just wondering. Uh, <laughs> I have no idea. Actually. We'll check the fine print. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Um, mm -hmm. Something else we're doing this year, uh, one of the gentleman who owns EDC Leather here in town is mm -hmm. doing a workshop for the kids, oh, a free nice. workshop where he's going to teach them how to do some leather braiding. Mm -hmm. uh, that's going to be fun. I love uh, that there's some crafting going on. Yeah, They're teaching them we, some things. We, you know, we're really trying to, you know, to do a lot of hands-on stuff. Mm -hmm. um, of course, you know, cosplay is a big part of yes. Vision Con. Yeah. And one of the local cosplay groups, uh, Ultimate Cosplay League, has um, set aside a couple blocks of time where they're getting as many of the cosplayers, not just in their group, but other groups as well, to come to their table and we'll take the kids there and then get pictures with their favorite characters. Oh my gosh. So, that's so fun. This is going to be great for the whole family, honestly. Ex exactly. That's what we were going for. It was We wanted things that, that kids could do with their parents. You know, no screens, no phones, right. no tablets. Mm -hmm. Just, you know, good fun that everybody could do together. Right. And we're always taking suggestions. So well, I wondered how you got your feedback. ideas because parents would have some good suggestions. Yes. we. We definitely encourage parents to, you know, get on our website mm -hmm. afterwards, or even, you know, drop me a note because right. uh, I'll be in the in the room most of the time for Vision Con. Drop me a note, and say, hey, I think this would be a great idea mm -hmm. for mm -hmm. next year. I think it's going to be so much fun. Yeah, it is. And do you encourage the kids to dress up if they want to? Absolutely. Right. Absolutely, we do. How fun! Hey, we want to give the details again. Tell everybody where it's at and, and the times. Okay, it is at the Springfield Expo Center, May tenth through twelfth. Mm -hmm. And um, for the next two days until midnight on Thursday, we have extended the 
pre-sale time, so you can still save fifteen dollars on a three-day pass. Very right. good, That's Christine. Great. Thank you so much. Thank Look you. forward to seeing yes, you there. It'll be great. All right, coming up, we're playing another round of Got You Covered. That's coming up next. We'll be back. That is, but I want to dress up just for dressing up. Absolutely. I'm just